Today, we will introduce you to the Workflow Designer feature of eFlow. eFlow's Workflow Designer provides a visual way to design and manage various approval workflow in an enterprise. With the Workflow Designer, users can customize the approval workflow for various functions, including leave approval, reimbursement approval, purchase approval, etc., according to their business needs. Let's learn how to use Workflow Designer together. First, open the approval form and switch to the Workflow tab in the top navigation bar to start creating the approval workflow. In the Workflow Designer, the left panel contains all available workflow nodes, and the right side is the canvas of the Workflow Designer, which contains the Start node by default. Now, let's drag an assignment node from the node panel on the left to the canvas, and connect the Start node and the Assignment Task node with a Flow Line Connector. When you move the node, the Flow Line Connector will move with it, which means the Flow Line Connector between the nodes is successful. On the top of the canvas, there are some shortcut buttons that help you manage the approval process easily. The Zoom In button and Zoom Out button can be used to adjust the proportional size of the canvas. The Full Screen button restores the canvas to its default proportions. The Line Type button allows you to select different types of connecting lines for different style requirements. Next, check the Assignment Tasks node. Below the Assignment Tasks node, there are four operation buttons. Click the Settings button to open the Settings panel of the Assignment Tasks node where you can configure the details of the node in the window. Click the Copy button to copy a new node. Clicking on the Line Type button allows you to modify the type of this flow line connector. Finally, click the Delete button to delete this node. This is the introduction of the eFlow Workflow Designer. Now you can easily create and manage customized approval workflow to improve work efficiency. If you're interested in learning more eFlow tutorials, please continue to follow our channel. Thank you for watching.